On November 3, 2024, Polish President Andrzej Duda announced the country's readiness to transfer its remaining fleet of MiG-29 fighter jets to Ukraine, conditional upon NATO allies ensuring the security of Polish airspace during the transition. This decision underscores Poland's steadfast commitment to supporting Ukraine amid its ongoing conflict with Russia and highlights its strategic role as a key NATO partner in Eastern Europe. Before the onset of the Ukraine conflict, the Polish Air Force operated a fleet of 28 MiG-29 aircraft consisting of 22 single-seat MiG-29A Fulcrum fighters and six two-seat MiG-29UB trainers. These Soviet era jets have been in service since the late 1980s, with some originally acquired from the East German Air Force post-reunification. As part of its modernization efforts, Poland has been seeking to replace these aging aircraft with more advanced, NATO-compatible fighters. To this end, the Polish Air Force has opted for the Lockheed Martin F-35 Lightning II and the KIF Abe 50 Fighting Eagle Light Combat Aircraft from South Korea. These modern aircraft will enhance Poland's air capabilities with advanced stealth technology, improved avionics, and greater interoperability with NATO forces. Poland has already demonstrated its support for Ukraine by delivering 14 MiG-29s in 2023, 4 in April and 10 in May. These jets, now actively serving in the Ukrainian Air Force, have significantly bolstered Ukraine's aerial defense, thanks to their compatibility with existing military infrastructure and the training of Ukrainian pilots. Poland's intention to transfer its remaining MiG-29s reinforces its commitment to strengthening Ukraine's defense capabilities. The MiG-29 Fulcrum, a twin-engine air superiority fighter developed in the late 1970s by the Soviet Union, is renowned for its agility and high thrust-to-weight ratio, enabling rapid maneuverability and effectiveness in dogfights. With a maximum speed of up to Mach 2.25 and an operational range of approximately 1,430 kilometers, 890 miles, without external fuel tanks, the MiG-29 is well suited for both defensive and offensive missions. It can carry a variety of air-to-air -air missiles, including the R-27, R-60, and R-73, as well as a 30mm GSH-30-1 cannon for close combat. Additionally, its capacity to carry air-to-ground ordnance enhances its multi-role potential. However, the MiG-29 lacks the stealth features, advanced sensors, and electronic warfare capabilities found in newer fifth-generation aircraft, which is why Poland is transitioning to modern fighters that can meet the demands of contemporary warfare. Poland has consistently been a staunch ally of Ukraine, providing extensive military and humanitarian aid since the conflict with Russia began in 2022. Beyond fighter jets, Poland has supplied heavy artillery, armored vehicles, and other critical equipment to bolster Ukraine's defenses. The decision to transfer the remaining MiG-29s, contingent on the acquisition of replacement aircraft, reflects Poland's strategic choice to continue enhancing Ukraine's aerial capabilities while aligning with NATO's collective defense strategy. This transfer will require additional NATO support, likely involving enhanced air policing, intelligence sharing, and the deployment of allied assets to strengthen Polish airspace security. Poland's ongoing support has solidified its position as a vital contributor to NATO's eastern defense posture and a key partner in Ukraine's resilience against Russian aggression. As the situation unfolds, Poland's commitment to Ukraine remains a pivotal element in the broader context of regional security and stability.